Communication and the Executive Committee, we extend to you very, very warm welcome. Most of you maybe it's the first time you've been here. I assure you, it will be a very brief ceremony. You will enjoy it. I will be very meaningful, short, brief, and you will really enjoy the whole ceremony. This ceremony, the ceremony of bliss, we all know I will be normally bilingual, a little bit Punjabi, then English, so that we can understand and participate in the whole process, what we are going to do here. We all know in human life, in history, in civilization, the entire efforts of humanity, human race, whole range of efforts aimed at only one thing, how to live peaceful, contented, and joyful life. For that, gurus, because this is Sikh ceremony, and the Sikh religion, Sikhism, as we all know, or maybe not all know, the youngest one, religion, of the world religions. It's just a little bit more than 500 years old, but its contribution to the human race and human civilization is far, far too greater. In this ceremony, as we all know, society goes by certain set of rules and regulations. In this ceremony, we do whatever we do, this whole paraphernalia, in the presence of Holy Majesty, Shri Guru Granth Sahib Ji. Holy Majesty, Sachi Patsha, we know these days Queen Elizabeth is celebrating her 90th birthday. Queen, kingdom, kingship. For us, the Sikh people, Gurus are the two kings and scripture, this holy scripture, like Bible. It's not Bible, it's a book. But for us, this scripture is living God for the believers. You see the whole paraphernalia, this canopy, this gorgeous clothes, and all set up. It's like we are in the presence of a king emperor. The true king who is with us here, who will be with us in the next world when we are no more physically in this world. So Guru Maharaj Di Huzuri Vich, Yanandakare Di Rasam, Asya Ramba Karange, Hune Hune Asi, Do Shabda Da Kirtan Kita. We just sang the praises of the Lord, God Almighty, who has given us everything, life, life supporting system, parent, society, this universe. And who has been kind to bring all us together today on this auspicious moment of this wedding ceremony, Balvinder Singh Chahal, son of Gurmeet Singh Chahal, and Bibi Kulwant Kaur, grandson of Parkin Singh Chahal, and Bibi Darshan Kaur Chahal, the grandparents, with Louis Piper, if I am correct in pronouncing the name. Louis Piper, okay. Daughter of Craig Piper and Barbara Piper. <laughs>
Must be all that milk you're drinking. He's taking for sure. I did actually. Oh, that's a
So if you'd like just to pass Louise by me to hold that hand for a moment. So we'll be passing from one family to another and you may be seated for a moment. I, Galvinda, take you, Louise, to be my wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do part. According to God's holy law, in the presence of God, I make this vow. I, Louise, take you, Valvinda, to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do part. According to God's holy law, in the presence of God, I make this vow. So in the presence of God and before this congregation, Alvinda and Louise have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands, and therefore I proclaim that they are husband and wife. I'd like to give them a round of applause. And in a traditional uh, Church of England uh, way, let me say uh, these words. Those whom God has joined together, let no one but asunder. As we sit, uh, let's just pray quietly for that window and Louise. A blessing prayer for you both. <coughs> God our Father, from the beginning you blessed creation with abundant life. Pour out your blessings upon Valvinda and Louise, that they may be joined in mutual love and companionship in holiness and commitment to each other for the rest of their lives. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And a special blessing. Valvinda and Louise, may God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit bless, preserve, and keep you both. The Lord mercifully grant you the riches of his grace, that you may please him both in body and soul, and living together in faith and love, may receive all the blessings of eternal life. Amen.
Um, Louise is the last married, last of our children to marry, and in the last few years we have gained uh, two daughter-in-laws and now son-in-law. Um, also we have three grandchildren now, um, so no, no pressure there. <laughs> Today, today were special days for our families being joined together and I um, hope there will be many, many special days um, on your journey together as you start the marriage life. Um, some words about Louise. Look beautiful. Uh, stunning yesterday, absolutely fabulous today. Very, very proud. Um, and my princess. Um, what can I say about you, Lou? <laughs> um, as Louise grew up, she took part in gymnastics, horse riding, singing, and loved the scariest rides on the theme park. But only if her brother Daniel would go on the rides with her. That's the only time she would go. Louise hated anything that made her dirty. Her clothes dirty, herself dirty, she had to be just so prim and prop, um, hence why she got the, the name Princess Louise. <laughs> she liked being a globetrotter, adventurer, visiting Cyprus, Paris, Prague, Turkey, skiing Austria, being terrified by scorpions in Egypt, no, in Tunisia, sorry, and camel riding and quad biking in Egypt. Um, is that Egypt? Egypt, yes. <laughs> Looking back at that tiny bundle 28 years ago, <laughs> you have blossomed into a fabulous young lady. Babinda, some words about you. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Louise looks like my princess and she is my princess, but wow, yesterday, were you the prince? Yeah. Well, well impressed um, with how, how you were. Even to the fact that some of the family didn't even recognise it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, uh, I've known Billy from his time at college. Um, sometimes watching him on, on a Monday night playing five aside with Jason and friends um, in East Leaf, trying to impress me with his footballing skills. <laughs> Um, didn't work. <laughs> but, <laughs> but um, Balinda has a fantastic, great character and personality, which is a direct result of his upbringing from all his family. With, I'm looking at you, Erin, and the rest of the sisters, with a good grounding for having three sisters keeping him in check. <laughs> Um, Balvinda, he will help anyone, any day, any time of the day, any time of the night. Um, so he was always willing to help someone first. Um, where he helps so many times on friends and family, he finds it hard to help, um, ask for help himself. Because um, he's always thinking about others first. Um, so that's a good, good character about Balvinda. Um, another thing about Balvinda, he knows what he wants. Um, he's got a determined mind and he'll reach the goals and will achieve anything that he set, sets his mind to. We are proud of Balvinda becoming our, our son-in-law and now for our families to be joined together. I'm um, just going on yesterday. Thank you very much for making us feel welcome yesterday um, at the temple. It was... It was um, a service that I thought was tremendous and it really made it. Um, with the priest coming over, um, something, sometimes things are just made to happen and for him to come over to, from Canada <coughs> helped us, the English side of it, I think that was absolutely tremendous and if something was meant to be, that was meant to be. Um, going on to Louise again. Her brothers, Her brother says um, often that she is high maintenance <laughs> and we've, we've, we've heard um, she likes her shoes and she likes her handbags already. 
So, Balvin, I hope you're ready for this. <laughs> Even though she's not any different to most um, majority of females, but they always like shopping for certain brands and labels. Um, and that desire, the nice things is, is fueled by working in the jewellery trade. Where in that jewellery trade she um, obtained or achieved the diploma in, in jewellery, or diplomas in jewellery, sorry, plural. Um, Louise's philosophy, quality over quantity, but has probably inherited that trait from her nanny. <laughs> With Louise um, being high maintenance, allegedly, um, knowing these facts, Louise thinking, how am I going to manage this? Um, so his preparation was thinking, I'm going to bring the corporate world into my married life. So he felt the need to work towards the Six Sigma in business, which is a highly efficient, recognized way of improving businesses. This has taken him to Prague, Geneva, and Derby. Sorry, Harry, that's what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> on, on Derby yesterday, Harry. Um, to his route, on his route to completing and to gain his knowledge of how he's gonna manage um, the so-called, allegedly, <laughs> high maintenance. So, after all that, Billy loves his Excel, so it's probably going to be cool <laughs> and analysed and controlled. <laughs> anyway, so all I'll say, um, coming to my close, is, Balvinda, there's no secret ingredient to a happy married life. But when you go a long journey together, saying a number of short answers is a long way <laughs> to happiness. And some of you guys are laughing, you know. <laughs> As in, yes dear, <laughs> will do, can do, okay, and I'm just about to do it. <laughs> That's my favourite one. <laughs> Valvinder and Louise, you are a good match with your characters and personality, which will complement each other very well. And I know Valvinder, you will take it from this day onwards. So we wish them all the happiness as their story begins. So that's my close. Um, but just when I'm to you. Um, but just, just to finish off, um, Louise, also Balvinder and Louise will make their way um, out through those doors there. And I would like you to come and join us in the gardens at the back there for the amazing champagne. Um, we'll wait for the photographs for you now. May God the Holy Trinity make you strong in faith and love, defend you on every side, and guide you in truth and peace. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be amongst you, and remain with you always, and all those whom you love. Amen.
Don't show me, but show everybody else. Turn the card. Turn the card. Guys, okay. Do you know what it is? Yeah. Watch this. Look, we're gonna place it back in the middle. That's not yours. No. No. Watch. Yeah, mate. Yeah, come over. Yeah, look, watch. Two or six of spades. Yeah, look. Not on the bottom. All the top. Six of spades. Yeah. I think it's six and nines. Look similar, don't they? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> You just flipped the net around, didn't you? I wish I did. <laughs> it's magic. Don't ruin it. I'll show you, I'll show you the slow motion. So six of spades from here. What the black you medical one? Like, yeah. You push it into the middle. It's going to jump from there to there. Push it all the way in. Go. Yeah. And jump. <laughs> it's a ten. <laughs> what on earth? It's in his mouth. He's a wizard. How are you doing? <laughs> Too much, you sir. Too much. Right. Me, um, can you unlock my phone for me? <laughs> yeah, hold, hold the phone. I mean, you know my pin code, just guess it. Something random. <laughs> oh, yeah. One more. Uh, try, try again, something. I mean, do you, have, do you have a pin code on your phone? No. No? Uh, I've got one on mine. What if your pin code was the same as mine? I mean, we can give it a go, can't we? Yeah, yeah. Just, <laughs> just hold up here. Have you got a trip? Oh, it didn't work. It didn't work. The thing is, the point of this is that you're all just guessing numbers. Yeah. You typed in random numbers, you typed in your pin code, it's just guessing numbers. I know what my pin is, you don't. So I'm going to think of the first number now and you're going to read my mind. Okay. Okay, look. Go with your gut instinct, what number am I saying in my mind now, the first number? Yeah, yeah. Okay, look, look at me. What number did you get to? Second number, let's say it out loud now, say it. Yeah, you know it though. Seven. Look at me now, next one, say it now. Go. Quickly. Yeah, one. Yep. Last one, you don't with yourself on the last one. So next one, what is it now? One. One, one, yeah? So for update. <laughs> <laughs> no, I loved it, nonetheless. Down well, Let's try, uh, can yeah. any of you shuffle, actually? Well, you can shuffle no. hard. <laughs> you've seen these are all different, yeah? Um, do me a favour, just uh, see your hands together. As we go through the deck, just say stop whenever you like. Go, Mr. Rowe. Okay. Take your card. Don't show me, but show everybody else. Get card control. Um, is there any way that I could know what card you chose? Yeah, I'm not looking at the <laughs> Is there any way that I could have predicted what card you were going to choose before we started? No, before we even walked over, look, I actually had one card in my back pocket. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and uh, there's nothing in my back pocket, so I'll tell you what we're going to do it again, look. We're going to get the two back to my pocket while you're all watching. It happens quick, look, three, two, one. See it go? We have jumped all the way back down. Put your hand up. I think you got to make sure it's on the back. Oh, keep going. But that's okay. We take the seven, we can change the seven to the two. And then the entire pack jumps in my back. How? Check it once. What would you go for? Seven. So you know the suit which is on the box of hearts, spades, and diamonds? Which one would you like? Seven of hearts. For everyone, it would be a seven of hearts. Yeah, there's probably one of seven of hearts. That's okay. Um, six, six, eight, four. Are you left handed or right handed? Yeah. 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 Can you use your four? Can you place your three on top? What's it? You're on seven of hearts. Try again, say so. There? That was the seven, would that be more than seven? Yeah. I'll take the seven, I hate getting it wrong, so I'll take that the four. Are you going to have the seven? Did you move that there, but all we did. Hey! <laughs> 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 
Why could we not do that right? They've been holding that for like half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> Loving can manage 
request you a request for Billy. <laughs>